Security First Corp. Safety through knowledge. How to send a magic packet to wake on LAN? Have you ever wondered how you can turn on your computer from another room or even from another network without physically pressing the power button? This is where Wake on LAN, W-O-L, comes into play, and it's all about sending a special message called a magic packet. To start, you need to ensure that your computer and network adapter support Wake on LAN. This usually involves configuring your BIOS and operating system settings. In your BIOS, look for the power management settings and enable WOL. In your operating system, go to the network adapter properties and make sure WOL is enabled there as well. Now, let's talk about the Magic Packet. This packet is a specially formatted frame that includes the MAC address of the target computer repeated multiple times. It's sent over the network as a broadcast to all devices, but only the device with the matching MAC address will respond. To send this Magic Packet, you can use various tools or even command line utilities. For example, you can use PowerShell on Windows. Here's a simple script to get you started. Define the MAC address of the device you want to wake, convert it into a byte array, create the magic packet with six bytes of all 255, followed by the MAC address repeated 16 times, and then send it using a UDP client. Imagine you're in a crowded room and you want to get someone's attention. You shout their name, and even though everyone hears it, only the person with that name will respond. That's basically what the magic packet does. It shouts the MAC address until the right device hears it and wakes up. When you send the magic packet, it travels across the network to the target device's network adapter. This adapter is always listening, even when the computer is in a low power state, waiting for that specific signal. If the packet is valid and matches the MAC address, the adapter signals the computer to power up or wake from sleep mode. This process is quite efficient and uses very little standby power, so it's not a significant drain on your energy consumption. However, if you're not using WOL, it's a good idea to disable it to save a bit of power. In summary, sending a magic packet to wake up a computer remotely involves configuring your system, creating and sending the magic packet with the right MAC address, and ensuring your network adapter is ready to listen and respond. This technology makes remote management a whole lot easier and more convenient. Thanks for tuning in to our video. Please like and subscribe and leave a comment below. See you in the next video.